Hey guys, Creative Inus here and welcome to another beautiful tutorial and today we will learn how to design this beautiful presentation slide so you can use this slide for a cover slide, thank you slide to showcase some points and you can also add few images and you have to experiment with it you can extend this box uh, and to, to add some content so I hope you will like it and please subscribe to our channel, join the membership and if you haven't subscribed please click on the red subscribe button and this will really help us and support us so let's begin with the tutorial the first step is that we need a background and it should be in a black and white tone something monochromatic so I have used this image and I have downloaded this from pexels.com and you can browse through uh, different images and you can download any image you want from pexels.com so once we have pasted the image on this slide now here you can see the design ideas and you can click on this design idea and it will uh, make this image 16 by 9 or you can go to this crop section and select the aspect ratio here 16 by 9 click on it and it will create a 16 by 9 crop ratio and just click on it and now you can adjust it on the slide like this now the next step is to insert a rectangular shape so let's draw this shape like this and place it at the center like this remove the outline so you have to click here no line now fill the white color increase the transparency to 30% and go to shadow effects and apply this shadow offset left and reduce the transparency and increase the size to 102% slightly increase, increase the blurness and and you can increase the distance as well and you can increase the transparency to 40% I think 40% looks much better align to middle now we need one more rectangular layer over it and for that you need to duplicate this layer and once you have duplicated it remove the shadow effect from this layer and also the transparency so now place it here like this now we have to fill the gradient fill in it click on this gradient fill and now you can see uh, by default it fills uh, some gradient color in it and we only need three gradient stops so these are gradient stops one two three and four we only need three so click on this icon here to remove a gradient stop now we have these three gradient stops so move the first one to the extreme left move the second one to the middle I think 50% is fine and third one is on the extreme right on the first one fill white color on the second one let's pick a nice color from the color palette so let's pick this blue color and fill the same color on the third gradient stop now on the first gradient stop increase the transparency so that we can start we can see the mountain range through this shape on the second gradient stop slightly increase the transparency so I think this 30 looks fine and on the third you can keep it like 10% so our gradient stops and uh, the gradient fill is done now comes the next part which is the text effect but before that we need to do one more thing let's insert this rectangular shape here remove the outline and now we need to fill uh, a gradient fill in it so click on the gradient fill so it will automatically pick the gradient fill from the previous shape but we only need two gradient stops here so remove one of the gradient stop 
on the first one fill white color and fill the same white color on the second gradient stop now on the second gradient stop increase the transparency to the 100% and move this gradient stop to 70% uh, so click on this gradient stop and you can uh, write here 70% or you can move this gradient stop on this slider to 70% on the first gradient stop, slightly increase the transparency to 20%. So, so now this part is done. Now we only need to add text. So for text, let's write. So for example, this is a cover slide for a case study. So let's write case study in caps. Select all the text, move it up, uh, change it to uppercase. So let's uh, pick a font so this is a new font we will try change the color to white I think 18 is fine let's place it here duplicate this text box place it here and let's write so this is a case study about a success so let's write success and increase the font size so this font size is fine and let's add some branding at the bottom let's write creative Venus and reduce the font size and increase the character spacing and duplicate it and let's write business presentations and you can place it here like this so this part is also done and we can do one more thing to make it look more beautiful uh, if you remember we have placed one layer behind this blue rectangular layer this layer so we need to extend that layer first move this to the side a bit so that we can extend it and slightly move extend it from the left and now you can adjust this blue layer so we only need this much of it like mm -hmm. this now duplicate a text box and go to shape format and rotate to left like this and place it here now increase the character spacing very loose and increase the font size by one point so let's make it 20 and place it here now edit this text box and let's write the year 2022 and you can place it here I think this looks fine and slightly adjust the this triangular effect if I want it to be more white here so reduce transparency to 10% here and also the background I would like to make it slightly darker so let's make it a make it darker a bit so this looks really beautiful so now we can do some more fun stuff here and you can do some more things here like you can put some company information here some social media icons but I like the clean look of it now Control D duplicate this to create different variations so this is a different variant now if you have to see the magic here click on this get in stop in the middle and pick this color and increase the transparency to 30 percent this looks really beautiful now again duplicate it let's try to change the colors go to more colors and let's try this 
this also looks very beautiful slightly move this white to the right so I think this one is my favorite so so this is how you can create different presentation slides corporate slides cover slides or uh, if you want to showcase few pointers so you can always write the stuff on this uh, shape you can extend this shape to the right to add more space you can play with it so that's how you can try different things so let's check the final output i hope you will like it so here is the final output i hope you will like it so here is the beauty of this beautiful uh, slide and you can see the color and the color looks so vibrant so beautiful so please subscribe to our channel join the membership hit like and share and share this beautiful presentation slide with your friends and colleagues and this one is my favorite and let me know in the comment box so which one is your favorite so we will see you guys in our next video till then Take care.